Like I'd founded in 95, we, you know, we remain 100% Canadian owned with the, you know, 200 technical staff. Um, uh, just as a note, we happen to have, a, you know, a few offices in Toronto. We have one in um, Markham, where it's actually our head campus is located, and another office in North York. Uh, an office also out of uh, Montreal, Quebec, and there's an office out of India that we have that we also run an engineering and a support team out of. Um, those logos you see at the bottom are just a sampling of the certifications we have. So. Uh, thematically, I mean, we are very, very highly focused on operational excellence. Privacy and security are two of the areas in which we've definitely made a commitment to excellence. Uh, whether you look at HIPAA, PIPEDA, uh, PCI, uh, safeguarding client information is really at the core of what we want to be able to do. We do not monetize client data. We are in the business of safeguarding and helping you safeguard your data and really are a uh, business focus is for clients and industries that really have a, a key interest in maintaining uptime uh, of their systems, you know, highly critical uptime industries, whether it's healthcare, energy, oil and gas, uh, transportation. We're not really uh, focusing so much on the regular kind of consumer market, but really the critical services sector. And that's really where we've uh, kind of tried to make our name and where we've been very fortunate to work with some really great companies uh, in those verticals. Um, government is also a very kind of significant focus for us. And again, we've been very fortunate to, to participate in some great projects uh, for the government and helping uh, in particular to be able to do uh, whether it's level one services for them or helping them to write a DR and um, BCP playbook uh, for business continuity uh, from a technical support perspective. So our expertise, uh, let me take a kind of a moment to just give you the span of what we what we do and where we play. Um, whether it's from managed services, contact center services, networking and internet and hosting, basically we try and look at this like a so-called uh, stack of services, whether you're talking from the facility side, hosting, and then the internet side of things in terms of really complex connectivity, uh, contact center, obviously being able to look at support for your clients for your products, and managed services, whether it's looking after technology for you uh, internally. And the list of capabilities, again, we take anything from a tier one type technical support, all the way up through looking at really complex interactions with database support, ERP support, um, as well as a kind of a service desk for informational and contact center. Um, in terms of what we look at from the data center aspect, and even in networking, we really made a hybrid first approach for our technology base. And uh, I, in particular, since I've had the tenure of uh, CTO over here, I've really taken an approach of making sure that we've really had a hybrid and private cloud approach, but really uh, approaching the market with a constructive uh, outlook with even the big three, um, with uh, Microsoft, uh, Google, as well as Amazon, and really forging some strong relationships and partnerships over there, because we really do believe it's got to be a hybrid first approach. And again, we've got some great partnerships on that side as well that, uh, you know, we've, I've been quite uh, excited to uh, to work with um, um, friends and partners on that side.